been shaming porch pirates all month here on Denver 7, and our Hall of Shame is full of petty thieves. Tonight, a new twist from shame to fame. A Lakewood woman refused to fall victim to a porch pirate this Christmas. Denver 7's Russell Haythorn with more on the theft, the chase, and the retiree who said, enough's enough. This typically quiet street saw some serious excitement just before Christmas. But never would I ever guessed I would do something like that. Yeah. Renee Abeda isn't normally a runner. No. <laughs> no, I'm retired and I just do a lot of stuff around the house and I'm busy. She was definitely busy that day last week. Just getting stuff ready for Christmas and... I saw something out the window. Her front door wide open, a woman lingering on her porch. On the ring doorbell video, the woman seemed to be in no big hurry. She just sat there for a while and then she got on her knees like she was fixing her hair and looking around. And then all of a sudden she made her move and grabbed it and took off. What happened next surprised even Renee. I don't know, something just came over me. A foot chase. What's your name? Did you just steal something? Give it. I'm going to f***ing call the police. I've got you on camera, b Give me the f***ing thing, now. Renee recorded the entire pursuit with her phone. You're on tape and you're in trouble. Now give it to me. Now, why are you stealing stuff? The exchange gets heated. Yes, you did, I saw you. Throw it down. And finally, the thief runs out of gas. And I couldn't breathe. I couldn't talk, but I called 911. The video quickly went viral. My youngest daughter put it on her Twitter account and, oh, it just went out of control. Turns out it was just a crockpot travel carrier in that package. A crockpot goes in it so you can carry it to somebody's house. Give it. And then after the fact, I was like, geez, I did all this for that. Renee has taken some heat on social media for taking the law into her own hands. I mean, Which it could have you know, it could have sight. turned sideways. Yeah. Thank goodness it didn't. But she doesn't regret it. If there's one thing she does regret about her now infamous video. Bad language, but. <laughs> as for charges against that porch pirate. I don't know. She's out there on every social media and every news channel now, so hopefully she's learned a lesson. In Lakewood, Russell Haythorn, Denver 7.